So one of the features of LinkedIn is the ability to endorse your network for their, their skill set. And with the new in under interface, you may be wondering where that is. So you may not see that box at the top um, suggesting endorsements, but um, if you want to strategically go there and endorse, um, this is how to do it. So you go to the profile. So we go to Morris's profile, for example. We scroll down, past experience, to um, skills and endorsements. And we see the top three. So these are either the three most endorsed skills or the three that the person has selected to be featured. So you can choose them. And to endorse for one of these skills, all we do is simply click on the plus next to their um, name next to the, to the um, skill itself. So if I want to endorse Morris for communication, because I've heard him speak, I can click plus. Um, and likewise with presentation skills, and we click plus. And then it, the plus turns into a tick and you know you've endorsed them for that particular skill. Your photo may come up here as well. If you want to know who else is endorsed, if I want to know who the other 17 people are, then I click on this little box here, and there's my name at the top as the most recent endorser, and I can scroll down and see who else is endorsed. Um, if it's all available, so there you go. And if I don't want to, if I want to take back my endorsement, I can simply click the tick and take it back. Or as you could see on the box, I can remove it from there as well. So, and, and if I want to go and endorse for some other skills, because I'm looking for something specific, um, maybe Morris gave a presentation on team building, I can find that he's got that here and click the plus here as well. And um, then, he can see um, all those endorsements that uh, will come through as notifications for him. So that's how to endorse people on LinkedIn with a new interface. This has been Joe from Wildfire Social Marketing. If you've got any other LinkedIn questions, um, feel free to ask me and I may create a video.